2017 Dubai Racing Carnival got underway earlier this month. Running from January to March, the festival comprises 10 international race meetings, contested by some of the most high-profile owners, trainers, jockeys and horses in the world. The spectacular Maidan Racecourse sets the scene for the carnival. Completed in 2010, it's an ultimate venue for horse racing. The grandstand alone is state-of-the-art, spanning 1.5 kilometers. It has seating for 80,000 spectators and covered parking for over 8,500 cars. The venue has set the standard for luxury and propelled the UAE's horse racing scene to greater heights in the international arena. Carnival cards take place every Thursday night at Maidan up until February the 23rd. There's then a 10-day break before the Super Saturday race meeting on March the 4th. It's considered an official dress rehearsal and will allow trainers to put the finishing touches to their equine stars ahead of the season-ending Dubai World Cup race day three weeks later on March the 25th. The who's who of the equestrian world, the elite of Dubai society and tens of thousands of racegoers will be in attendance for the richest race day of racing in the world. With 30 million US dollars in prize money on offer, the race day will feature nine high-class races, including six Group 1s and three Group 2 contests. Racing will be brought to a close on the evening with the $10 million Dubai World Cup, won last year by California Chrome. Shane Ryan has the button, gates fly, they're racing in the Dubai World Cup. Chrome turns to gold. California Chrome wins the Dubai World Cup from Hook to Hinge and California Opportunity. California Chrome has gone on to become the world's richest racehorse and Mukta Hij can only be considered as gallant in finishing second. In true Dubai style, festivities on the day will end with their dazzling display of fireworks and spectacular World Cup show. There is so much to look forward to.